why am I so loud? Okay, anyways, hey y'all. So, I am back today with a different type of video. I am going to show you guys how I do all my packaging and all of that. If you guys don't know, I do own the website bagitup.com. B-A-G-I-P. You peep. Do I not know how to spell my own website? B-A-G-I. <laughs> no, no, y'all. I'm tripping right now. V-A-G-I-T-U-P-P-P-P. Bagitup.com. I'm going to put it below. Please, y'all. I'm tired. Please excuse me. I'm burnt out right now, okay? But yeah, yeah, I do know I sell gold plated jewelry. So I'm going to show you guys how I package and ship my orders and, you know, do the whole like shebang type of thing or whatever, okay? And everything that I use, I am going to put it down below, like where I get my bubble millers from. I use black bubble millers. I usually order like 100, 200, 500 sometimes. So I'm going to put everything below. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to show you guys what website I use, just all of that, okay? Okay, so this is the printer I use. Y'all can see Dymo. D-Y-M-O label printer, I mean label writer 450 turbo. So the reason why I picked this one, um, as y'all can see, the reason why I picked this is because a lot of um, things on YouTube, let me just continue talking this way. A lot of um, printers on YouTube said like, oh, this printer jams a lot, this printer jams, and I don't have time for that. So I don't want to jinx myself, but I will say ever since I had this printer, I had this printer for like three years now it has not jammed on me and I do print out sometimes like 50 60 70 and even one time like 90 labels at once and it did not jam so let's just pray you know sometimes when you say stuff you get too excited stuff like that happens so it hasn't been jammed on me yet so yeah as y'all seen I did just open up a new box of bubble mailers I'm not sure but this looking like 500 y'all this is a lot I think this is like 500 say hi Hanky say hello I think this is 500 because this is a lot y'all so this is a new box so I'm about to use this for my orders okay so if y'all can see I have all this unfulfilled orders so I need to make sure I fulfill all of this all of this I need to sit down and do all of this so can y'all see how like um I checked all these boxes except for one person so that per one person has a um a red a red um, explanation point so that's this is what I love about Shopify when it has that red explanation point like that um I figured figured y'all want to see my beautiful face as I explain so when it has that red explanation point like that I usually refund the customer their order right away because that means it's high risk of fraud it's not 100 you know the site is just giving you an estimate no site is 100% correct they they in fact can be they in fact could be someone that's not a fraudist is that a word but um I did have a situation before where I seen that and I still sent the order out and the person ended up did a chargeback so now I don't even play around if you have a red um explanation point after you place the order and my website don't trust you if my website don't trust you baby girl I'm not trusting you so that's just how I do it y'all keep it simple when it comes to business don't say oh maybe no if it says maybe fraud just it doesn't hurt they can buy their their jewelry or something somewhere else so that's just what I do okay I right, y'all so look at these two bubble mailers which one look more expensive don't you see this you can already see it feels like paper like nothing like plastic and y'all see this it feels thick durable it even looks prettier so I'm gonna try to find exactly where I got this from so I can put this in the bio below because this is cheap this is very very bomb quality okay so y'all um pretty much most of my packages that I ship out are um four ounces Four to eight ounces. So honestly, like this is probably a very getaway. I'm coming. I'm coming to y'all very, um, very. What's the word? I'm not sure. But I'm not over here trying to act like I do it perfect, glistening, and glam. If I had the weights of each item on my website, this would be easier. But I don't honestly because listen, y'all, my life is a mess. I know I really need an assistant. So what I'm gonna do is, depending on what she ordered, she ordered some hoops, a necklace, and an anklet she ordered a good amount of stuff so that could be a little heavy so i'm probably gonna put like seven ounces honestly listen i've been doing this and nothing happens at the post office it's perfectly fine so if you want to do it how i do it do it. if you don't oh well okay all right y'all so this process is pretty repetitive so i'm just gonna keep um doing this or whatever this is gonna take probably <laughs> some time because i'm trying to do i don't know if i can do 40 at once but i'm about to do 40 at once so let's see if it works okay and y'all don't be making fun of my laptop. I know y'all probably like, why you don't got no 
no MacBook or nothing, okay? Y'all, um, I'm not... I'm not doing, I'm not getting a MacBook because like, I'm not getting a MacBook because like, um, see it's hard for me to do this and that. I'm not getting a MacBook because like, I don't even be on my computer like that. I'm not about to get a MacBook just for this. Like, that's what, ooh, I can put my chair this low. Oh, period. See, y'all can see me and see this. So, I'm about to go ahead and put, um, all the, I'm so scared because if I do, what? If I do all of these weights and I can't print out this much at once, I'm going to cry. But I think I can. <sighs> Let me show y'all another cool thing that I like about Shopify. Let me show y'all. So, y'all, y'all, it can show you, like, this is why I love Shopify. Like, people, I know they have wigs and things like that. But I love Shopify, especially for this reason. But I don't, I'm pretty sure wigs do this. But let me just show y'all how it's at the top of your page. Like, when you go to, um, can y'all see this? This is why I love it. Because it's showing you, like, I have five people on my website right now. So, I love that. You can low-key, like, see what they're doing on your website and things like that. So, I really do love that about I'm trying to figure out why the heck it said, hmm. but let me do all this right now. Honestly, I do recommend getting a scale to know exactly how much the um order costs. You know, I think it's very important, but I'm, I find this easier, y'all. This is how I do it, okay? Um, and I've been doing this since I had Bag It Up, and I've had Bag It Up for September, I think, will be a year. Wow, I should have a one year something for everybody. I'm so. Hey Siri, what is one pound to ounces? One pound is 16 ounces. One pound is 16 ounces. Um, Someone got two golden link chunk bracelets. I'm not sure if y'all know what that is, but they're pretty heavy. So two of those will make almost a pound probably, okay? This is so. <laughs> The way I do stuff is horrible. Please do not do your stuff like this. Okay, y'all. So, um, let me show y'all that. On the website right here, y'all, it says... Can y'all see? It says the customer paid $12 for expedited shipping. So, she paid for expedited shipping. I have to change shipping services right here. And I'm going to have to click priority mail. Priority mail is expedited because it usually takes two business days, sometimes one. So, um, I'm going to use the priority mail or whatever. There y'all go. Instead of regular mail. So, she's going to get it way faster. So, I always just do half or one third of shipping labels at a time. So, I was like, oh, let me finally be see if I can do a lot at once. You know what I'm saying? So, I clicked all 47 and look what it says, y'all. It says that you can only purchase shipping labels for 20 items at a time. So, that's something to keep in mind. I don't know if it's just Shopify website, if it's just USPS or what, but keep that in mind. I can only purchase 20 at once. So, I just did half and I got to do the other half after. Okay, so now I'm going to go back to orders and I'm going to do the other half of orders. Side note, y'all, I am on a chat with um, Shopify right now. So Shopify, because of the home pandemic, they stopped doing um, phone calls. I think it was just too much for them to handle. So I am talking to them that um, my um, Shopify actually stopped. See, this is this is one-on-one -on -one business. This is just coming to y'all real and raw. So I got a new card. I get a new card every five seconds because I'm always losing my bank card. Always losing my card. Yeah, I never have a card. I'm be completely honest. So if someone ever try to do anything, you know what? Y'all, I never have a card. I'm going to tell y'all that. I lose my card every two days and I don't know why. But anyways, I got a new card. So they tried to um, they tried to charge my card and it did not. Because, you know, I got a new card. So um, it did say I couldn't purchase any more shipping labels till I changed my card. I never even knew that. Um, I forgot to even change my card, clearly, you know. So um, now I'm talking to them because I did change the card and it's still not working. So let's see what that's going on because I want to print out the other half of the labels actually. So let's see. Oh, okay. Um, do you have anything available for this week? Do you know of? Um, I am pretty, pretty booked up honestly, but... Okay, y'all, so I actually want some advice. This is the original chain for um my initial necklaces. This is the original chain. 
You see, just a it's like a rope type of chain. Should I change it to this one? This looks more richer and pretty, I think so. Uh, but I don't know. I thought this looks more classy. But now that it's next to this, it looks skimp and a little ghetto now. Not ghetto, but you know what I'm trying to say. So, y'all, please let me know. I really do want y'all advice. Like, which... Um, which actual chain should we use for the pendant? I'm not sure. I think this is this is giving unisex too. This looks more girly, and this one looks like men and women can wear it. That's why I like it. Okay, so y'all, as y'all can see, um, my shipping came up to sixty three dollars and twenty four cents, and I did save eighteen dollars. So see what I mean? You can do oh shoot, what did I do? Let me buy a shipping label. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> Say all this is all everything that I have to um package up. Okie dokie. At the end of the day, business is business, but one of my customers actually reached out to me that she really needs her order ASAP. Um, she did pay for expedited shipping, but expedited shipping does not um, include the processing time, like me packaging the order, things like that. But I hurried up and packaged her order, and I am going to run to the post office to drop up her order. You know, I just love to keep y'all happy. So she's getting a little special treatment right now. I don't even know her, but it's just like, I feel like, you know, she reached out to me. She really needs it. You know what? Let me just hurry up, give this to her real fast, and then I'm going to do the other orders, okay? Okay, y'all, so I like to basically put it in as I do it. So Ashley wants an A-S-H, so this is her name. A, I just want to A, this is an H. I like to read it out loud as I do it so that I make sure that I don't, like, you know, miss anybody or anything, whatever. So Ashley, baby girl, baby girl Ashley, you about to get, it's like, no, let me not even talk like that. Yeah, you guys know I'm super proper. I'm just, my name is Lanisella. So, A-S-H, cool. She wants a double stack ring, y'all. This is double stack ring, it's so cute. She wears a size seven, so size seven double stack ring. She also wants the goddess bracelet. Oh, did I show y'all? She wants the goddess bracelet. This is fire. This is fire. Okay. <laughs> And I'm going to put this in a separate bag because it is pretty much a lot. She also wants, I'm going to use a smaller bag for this. She wants a Nefer, uh, Eternity Ring, just a size 7, y'all see this? And she wants um, a tennis bracelet. It's super cute, simple, simple and cute, y'all see this? She got a size 17, so she must have smaller hands. So, I just make sure I read everything out loud. Yep, I got, I think I got her whole order. So I'm going to go ahead and remember I put it, oop, this bag is messed up. Remember I put it in this type of bag first. Then I'm going to go ahead and put it in her priority mail envelope. Good to go. I'm gonna put up the rest of the other stuff. And this is trash. Mm. Oh, alright, so y'all, this is almost this is basically everything minus like the 10 things that um this is basically everything minus like the 10 packages that did that has some issues that I have to sort out. Ugh, okay, y'all, so I am finally, finally basically done. I am at the Oh, I'm so tired, I packaged order for four over four hours. Who's this? Over four hours. So y'all, I'm finally done. I was able to sort out things about the other orders very fast. So let me show y'all most of the orders all done. So this is all the orders all done. All done done. I don't want to get all extra sentimental and stuff, but like I really, really, really do appreciate everyone for literally like supporting my business. When I first started Bag It Up, like no doubt in my mind that I think it wasn't going to work out. Like I definitely thought my business would be decent, but I thought it would be decent like 
500 a $1,000 a month. Something little, you know, like something to just use for snacks or just, that's really what it was for. Like, for Hank food, because Hank is expensive. You know, like, that's what I thought. But, y'all, my business has been growing so, so, so much. Like, oh, my gosh. Do I feel, I feel like I'm about to cry, but I'm just so, like, grateful and thankful that everyone really, really supports me. I just thank God, literally, because, like, yeah, this is not a million orders, but... For me to have a business that's less than a year, my business is not even one years old. Like, the orders and the amount of support I get is crazy. Every day somebody's tagging me in something. Every day somebody's reposting. I just can't, like... I just can't thank y'all enough. And I just want to say, like, if y'all want to give up on your business, please do not. Remember, you are your biggest, your biggest, like, what do I say? I don't know if I should say model, supporter, your biggest face of your business. So if you need to, if you need to get dressed, put on your jewelry, put on your glasses, put on, whatever you sell, if it's hair, make sure you're always looking up to par. Like I always say, I know y'all always hear me say, make sure you look like what you sell. Y'all always see me with jewelry on. And I even usually wear a little bit in the house. But I don't have nothing on right now. But y'all, I never step out the house without wearing jewelry. Like, make sure people know that's you. I say that all the time. And I can't stress that enough because I'm still seeing people walking around. And I don't know what you're selling. But you're telling me you do makeup, you know? So, I just want to say, like, thank you guys so much. Like, I can't. Even Hank is saying thank you. Say thank you, Hanky. I'm Shelby. You hungry? You hungry? He needs to get washed, y'all. But I can't be any more grateful. The way Bag It Up is moving, y'all. It looks like it's making me be closer to my dreams, my goals. Like, it, it looks like it's, it's looking very promising. Like, I may can stop doing actual clients maybe by next year. Like, if God willingly, you know. So, I'm just going to keep going. And that's it. To the top we go. Oh, 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 oh,